Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an Amazon clothing haul. I have a big pile here of stuff that I have been collecting over the past few weeks and I'm gonna go ahead and try it all on for you and tell you guys sort of my first impression thoughts. Most of this I have not worn yet. There are just, I think, two of the shirts that I have worn, um, including the one that I'm actually wearing now. Um, so yeah, I'll go ahead and show it all to you, try it all on for you, and everything that I got, I will link below as long as I can still find a link for it, obviously, but it was within the last couple of weeks, so I should be able to. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started with what I'm actually wearing. The bottoms that I'm wearing are these um, Nine West Pawn Crops, and they are, um, I actually got one pair of these, which is the ones that I'm wearing currently in at Sam's Club. And then I loved them so much that I tried to go on samsclub.com and order more of them and I couldn't find them. So I ended up ordering a black pair, another pair of black, and then another jean pair off of Amazon. They were a little pricier on Amazon. I want to say that they were like $30 on Amazon versus at Sam's Club, they were like $15.99, but I feel like I'm gonna be wearing them all summer. So I just wanted to show you that because I'm pretty much gonna be wearing them um, at least for the first few shirts that I try on and then I'll switch to the black so I don't have to explain it every time. Okay, let's go ahead and get started and I'll go ahead and show you this first outfit. Okay, so this first top here was actually suggested to me um, on the suggestion page as like the top seller in shirts for women currently on Amazon. So I was like, okay, whatever, I'll buy it. So I do like it. It has these slits in the side, as you can see, and it fits really well. Like it's kind of like a t-shirt material, but then it's like form fitting enough to actually look decent. So I am really fond of this and I'll actually show you in a minute that I have it in another color. This is in a size large and then these are those pants. So they are, like I mentioned, a pull on, but they're, you know, straight denim. So they look like jeans, they fit like jeans, except they have the pull on waist to make them a little bit more comfortable. So these this shirt and these pants are probably my favorite combination that I got so far. So again, I haven't exactly worn it all, but yeah, let's go ahead and move on to the next thing. This next top is a tank top by the brand Inin. I believe it's I-N-I-N. -I -N. And it's just this like, this is a little bit more form fitting than I would have liked. So I did order this in a large, but I think that if I order another one, I would order it um, in an extra large, just cause I like things to be a little bit like looser fitting, but I also am currently trying to lose weight. So I don't know, like I'm not against this enough to like send it back. I just want to lose a little bit of weight. I got a, a nice farmer's hand from yesterday. I just want to lose a little bit of weight before I actually like end up wearing it because you can see these jeans, like since they're pull on, they do sort of show like where, you know, you know, they're big enough, obviously, but they will sort of show, you know, the cut in my stomach right there where they sit. And so like a tighter form fitting shirt just doesn't really work. So while I do like this shirt, I think it would definitely go better with different pants for sure. I do like how it has the triangle of the leopard there and then the leopard pocket on the chest right there. So I do like the idea of this shirt, like I said, just don't think that I would wear it with these bottoms. This shirt was $14.99. Let's go ahead and move on to a dress because I did find some really cute spring dresses. I bought two that I definitely wanna show you guys. So let's go ahead and move on to a dress next. Okay, so this is the first dress. I'll show you the full dress in a minute. This is actually by the brand Roz and Alley, which if you are not familiar with, is actually a dress barn brand. I'm not sure if Dress Barn actually went out of business or not, but this is their brand. The tag on this, it says it should be $54.95. I don't know if you can see that, but I actually only paid $19.99 for this dress. So I'm pretty happy with it. It is a, I'm going to back, I'm going to back all the way up so that you can see it. It is a floor length maxi dress. 
and I feel like it is very flattering even though it is like like tighter and more form fitting it definitely is a very flattering dress so I'm actually going out of town this weekend for my sister-in-law's or no I'm sorry my sister my sister's bachelorette party and I'm thinking of taking this with me to wear out one night or to dinner one night or something like that um so yeah I am very happy with this purchase but I actually think I like the next dress and I'm going to show you better so the next one is also well I'm not sure if it's the the same brand but it's also a brand like a more popular brand that you wouldn't find typically on Amazon, I guess maybe unless you search for them. All brands are on Amazon. Everything's on Amazon. Okay, let's move on to the next dress. So far, this is my favorite. Okay, so this is the next dress. And this one also is that same brand. I can't remember what. Roz and Ally. So again, the Dress Barn brand, this is that. And this one was only $19.99 as well. I feel like this one is super flattering for spring, just like a date night or even just to throw on and like head to dinner in or whatever in the spring and summer. I do think that I'm a little bit large chested, like it's kind of, you know, pulling there. And I feel like I'll have to keep adjusting that, which is the only reason why I would say that I like the other one better. Um, this one is about knee length as you can see there. And while I do like it, like I said, I this stripe down the middle, like, I don't know, the model was definitely smaller chested than I am. So I think that definitely, you know, can play with that. But I do like the floral on the shoulder here. And then it goes all the way down the back is just that floral. And then the front has that like center. Um, it actually is floral as well. They're like some little blue flowers. This one I would say is probably more appropriate for like church or a dinner with family or something like that where, you know, there's no like cleavage or anything like that. Whereas the other one will wear out at a bachelorette party on this weekend. So, I mean, that one just shows a little bit more cleavage. So yeah, that is the second dress. And now I'm going to go ahead and move on to the next thing. Um, I have a few more shirts to show you and a few more pairs of pants. So let's go ahead. Okay. So I'm actually wearing the black pants now. Um, and these ones actually still have the tag on them. So I got these pants, all of them, all three pairs in a size 12. And I would say definitely size down. So I am typically between a 12 and a 14, just depending on like if stuff has stretch or if it's form fitting or whatever. Um, but these were really big and the reviews both on Sam's Club and on Amazon speak to that. Like that they, especially as you wear them throughout the day, definitely get bigger. So if you're gonna buy these, size down on them or like pick the lower of your two sizes if you're between sizes. Just wanted to throw that out there. And then this top you guys have actually seen before. I wore this in my grocery haul last week, I think. Um, I was wearing it that day just with like some black leggings. It's just a simple like t-shirt material and then it has the permanent knot in the front there. And I really like this shirt. It's a lot more casual, but it doesn't look so casual. Like you could wear it with leggings and it's not gonna be like, I don't know. It, I think it's a little bit dressier than just wearing like a t-shirt with leggings. I got a little knot in the front, you know? So I really do like this one. And this one was $9.99, I believe. This, was, this one was super affordable just because it's just, you know, a t-shirt essentially. And they had it available in literally any color that you could possibly imagine. So definitely this is like a staple of mine. I feel like I'm gonna go on and order every other color because it helps it shape so well throughout the day. Um, this one is in a large as well. Pretty much everything that I got Yes, everything, both the dresses, all the shirts are in a large, and then the pants are in 12s. So yeah, take for that what you want, but yeah. So definitely am liking this shirt, and this one will get a ton of wear this summer. The next one I have is that same shirt from the beginning, the um, black and white starch one, except it is pink. And I actually like this one better. Like I feel like it fits a little bit better. Um, the other one, the slit on the side was like deeper and so it formed a little weird 
um, crease like at my hips, but this one doesn't do that. And this one's actually like just feels bigger in general. It almost feels like a different material. Um, so like I mentioned, I actually have another one of these coming that was in a print that they considered like hot or popular or whatever. And so it's not going to come until like mid May, I think, but I'll show you guys that on my story or whatever. I'm sure you'll see me wear it. Um, so yeah, I really do like this one. These shirts were $22.99 a piece. I think that they were the most expensive thing that I bought, except they had like a 25% off discount or something like that. So I did get them at a little bit of a discount, like, you know, one of those Amazon, like click here to you to get an extra whatever off at checkout. I did that with, with these shirts. So it made it a little bit more affordable. So I have one more thing to show you guys. Um, and that is something that I've actually worn already as well. So the last thing I have is just this green, it's like an olive green and it's not quite, it's like those baseball sleeves, right? So like not short sleeve, but not quarter sleeve. That's sort of in the middle between your shoulder and your elbow length. And this one is just like a standard, um, top. I purchased this one mostly because I really feel like the color green brings out my skin tone well. So that's literally the only reason that I bought it because they had it in this green color. But yeah, I feel like this one is just a classic like throw on with a pair of shorts type of shirt as well. You'll find that I am definitely more of a casual dresser versus somebody who like you know, dresses up all the time. So shirts like this and like that gray one with the knot and even the pink one are definitely my go-tos for the summer because comfort over everything. So um, yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this try on video. Let me know what your favorite is down below. I definitely 100% think that my favorite is this dress that is now inside out. Um, I just feel like it's gonna be so, and it's real light. Like the material's not real heavy, so I feel like it's gonna be really great for the spring and summer to just throw on, especially when we go to the beach in the summer. I mean, it's definitely more of a spring colored dress, but I'm not super like, oh my gosh, can't wear this after this month or whatever. So I'm wear it all the time, you know? Um, so yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below what your favorite was. And I will see you guys next Wednesday, probably since I'm going on that bachelorette trip, I probably will not be able to get a video up on Monday, but Wednesday I should have a pretty big grocery haul for you guys because I have not grocery shopped since the 30th of April. And it is by that point will be the 11th, the 30th of March. And by that point it will be the 11th of April. So almost two weeks, we're going to do some shopping. So, okay guys, thanks so much for watching this video and I'll see you next time. Have a great weekend. Bye.